What's up guys? Tony Rican here and today I'm going to throw down with a really cool lunch or dinner or whatever you want to make it as. I'm going to be making some shrimp tostadas. You know exactly what these are, don't you? That's right. These are awesome. So let's just go and get started and jump right into this one. Remember guys, if you love all the cool stuff I'm putting out here on my channel, the easiest way to make sure it keeps on rolling and help the channel grow is just to hit like and share on this video. Drop a comment down below, then go ahead and subscribe and share my YouTube channel. That way, every Monday and Friday, you'll get a brand new, really cool, simple recipe just like these shrimp tostadas. Which to start, I'm going to start mixing the seasoning. For that, we're going to take some chili powder some cumin, oregano, onion powder, garlic powder, then I'll add some salt and pepper, a little bit of oil, get that mixed together, and then I'll drop my shrimp in and coat that. While our shrimp sits in those awesome seasonings, absorbing all that flavor, we're gonna start prepping everything else. I'm gonna start with a basic guacamole. For that, we're gonna take a couple of avocados. I'm gonna take juice from a lime. Then I'm gonna chop a little bit of cilantro, some garlic, add some salt in there, and mix that all together. Once the guac is done, I'm going to work on my pico de gallo. For that, I'm going to chop some tomatoes. I'm going to mince up some jalapeno and garlic. Some lime juice then a little bit of red onion and cilantro, and I'll mix that together. Now that everything's prepped, we're ready to finish this one off. I'm gonna go ahead, take that shrimp that's been soaking in those great flavors, and heating up a pan, I'm just gonna throw the shrimp in there for a couple of minutes on each side, and the shrimp will be done. Now if it's warm out, you could do this on the grill, same thing, shrimp a couple minutes on each side, and we're all set to go. Okay. And now all that's left is to put it all together. I have my tostada. What I'm gonna do is take some guacamole, take some of that shrimp, and top it with that fresh pico. And there you guys go. There's our little shrimp tostadas. Like I said, you could also do these on the grill if it's nice and warm out. It's freezing right now, so I can't. But these look freaking awesome. You know, I can't just look at this either. I gotta go ahead and dig in and just give this one a try. Sorry about that. I took a huge bite because I wanted to make sure I got some shrimp in there, but you guys are gonna love this one. So go ahead, like, share, comment on the video down below. Go ahead and like and share my uh, YouTube channel. If you need complete step-by-step -step printable instructions, head over to my averagegoygourmet.com. Give this one a try and we'll see you guys next time.